another video we're back to a regular schedule i'm back i wanted to do a little retail therapy or what what do what they i don't know shopping therapy i don't know i just want to go shopping because i didn't really i didn't really go crazy when i went on vacation so i'm not saying i'm gonna go crazy here i'm just saying i kind of want to look around i kind of miss target it's been like two three weeks since i've been to target and that's a lot for me so i need to see target and also i'm gonna go to ulta because i'm trying to find something for my under eyes i know y'all know it's not a secret i know i have bags i know i have dark circles yes i'm very aware of it i'm aware of it so i'm trying to find something i saw a girl do like um some bags i, I i'm not good at explaining things y'all know i'm not good at explaining things but that's why i took a picture so at ulta i'm trying to get some under eye masks and i believe it's like cooling and then it kind of gets rid of the puffiness in your eyes when you wake up so hopefully i can find this specific brand i'm looking for a topical topical faded under eye mask so and we might go to bath and body works is that the same bath 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 yes bath uh, bath and body works why does it make it sound so similar yes we're gonna go to bath and body works because i know they're having a sale i probably won't get anything because as i told you guys previously there's a lot of changes coming that's all i'm gonna say there's a lot of changes coming so i don't want to buy too much and eh, we don't need to buy a lot right now okay so really we're just gonna window shop for the most part eh, unless we see something out of this world like that hello kitty mirror let's go into ulta right now okay y'all quick update i can't really talk much because one, there's people walking around the aisles, and two, there's music playing. So, um, when I came in, a lady helped me, and she told me good molecules was good for patches, but they don't have the one that I showed you guys or told you guys about, topical. They don't have that. So, she recommended these. She recommended these and good molecules. So, I will kind of show you guys around and probably just do a voiceover. So, this was one of the brands that I was looking at. Just wanted to show you guys the price real quick. And then I was also looking at Pixie, but Pixie is very taxed, so I'm gonna hold off on that one. I was also looking at mirrors because my mirror is very messed up, so but we'll hold off on that for now. Anytime I come to Ulta, I have to stop by the nail section. They have so many cute nail options compared to like the drugstore or Target. I mean, look at that love them i didn't get any this time because i do have a lot right now but i always like to look around and see if they have any new stuff so i'm thinking i get these extreme shampoo and conditioner last time i got that bottle right there skin tone color i don't know gold color whatever you want to call it but you guys know my hair is damaged that's why i actually cut it but the lady that i talked to last she recommended this for my hair so i'm thinking i get these now i know y'all see the price is 50 dollars, but that little bottle right there is 25 so you might as well just get the bigger one i don't know that's 100 dollars though so i don't know i'm thinking i might just get the um the sham i forgot which one i need is it the shampoo or the conditioner i can't remember crap <laughs> i might have to get back to y'all on this one i'm gonna have to come back once i'm done with both bottles because i'm done with one but technically i'll be okay so once i'm done with both but once i'm done with the shampoo bottle then i guess i'll come back and get the conditioner all right that was kind of a fail but not really anytime i can save money a win is a win so i might have to order those patches because i was doing a lot of research and those might be one of the best ones the ones that i told you guys about topicals under eye patch stuff so i might just have to order that because i don't I don't know where else to find them. I looked it up and it looks like they just have it on their website. Let's go to Bath and Body Works. I probably won't talk. They always have a lot of music and it is a Friday so it's probably gonna be packed and I don't like to talk and be loud. So I might just do a voice over there. I don't know, we'll see. Or we just put on some good music and we just vibe out to the candles. Obviously this video will not be up but just keep an eye up keep an eye out on bath and body works candles there's a lot of sales going on right now so don't miss out don't miss out i've had my hands off the website because i don't want to buy more candles 
I have a candle addiction and a candle can candle holder addiction too. Last time I went in there, I bought a $80 candle holder. Was that necessary? No. Did I feel it was? Of course, but no, we are not doing that this time. I don't care how cute it is, you guys, please, please don't let me go out of there with a candle holder, please. <laughs> because they're so taxed on top of that. Oh my goodness, but there's a sale. The candles are, t all the three wick candles are $10 today, so. I know you guys won't see this by the time it's up, but there's been a lot of sales where they've been $10, so keep an eye out for that and other good sales. Y'all know it's the summer, sales right around the corner. It has been really hot already, the summer hit, and I don't know what part of the world you are in, but I am somewhere where, the, where it's really, really, really hot, so please stay hydrated, get your umbrella, get a hat, sunblock. Hey, protect yourself, man, because it's hot. And do not forget to wear deodorant. Don't step out the house without the ornaments. Boom, we got the deals. Let's look at it. So it's actually been a while since I've come to Bath and Body Works and honestly, mm, you're not missing much, I'm telling y'all. You're not missing much. There wasn't any new candle stands per se, candle holders, whatever you want to call them. And then sometimes the stuff that's on sale is not even anything that's worth buying, to be honest with you. So, but on, an, on another note, you guys will see something new that they put out as far as smells that I was shocked about. Look at that butterfly. Oh my god. So cute. If they had a wallflower plug sale, I would go running to the store. Because look at that price. It was literally $15, y'all. <laughs> I put that back. I was shocked by this, y'all. They have Halloween candles now. I was like, oh my god. That's crazy. All right, you guys, I went in there and honestly, I guess I didn't miss anything because everything kind of looks the same from the last time I saw it. And it's been some months. I was surprised though that they put out the Halloween candles. Did y'all peep that? The Halloween candles. And I actually saw somebody make a post because I also follow a lot of people that post about the bullseye area at Target where they were saying that a lot of the Halloween stuff is coming out, pumpkins, all that good stuff. And I was shocked because it's still the summer. So, I mean, I don't know. We have a long ways to go till October. What's the rush? Literally three, four months until October. Come, come on now. Come on now. What about 4th of July? Did y'all forget about 4th of July? Jesus, they just, they're moving quick. They're ready for the next year. Meanwhile, I'm still here and this year. It's crazy. All right, you guys, we're here at Target, Bullseye area. So over here, it's really still just a bunch of summer stuff, as you guys can see. Really glad to see it. Have y'all seen this on TikTok where you can buy this for your car? That way you don't make a mess in the car if you're a messy eater like me for $5. Some bins for storage, $3. For this, I suggest you go to Ikea. Oh, they got these colorful little pillows. Oh, looks kind of cool like this i think this might be a fourth of july thing kind of cute floating wireless speaker wow they get creative y'all lapton sun and privacy shade yep i need one of the oh adult sunglasses i need some new sunglasses oh look at this calendar a little late but you know never too late for a calendar five dollars what is this a brush holder okay creative i love the creativity what is this what is this? Treat yourself, what? Desktop candy dispenser, what? <laughs> that's, hey, I'm not gonna lie, that's tight. That's tight. A froggy wireless speaker. Motivational things, little things to drink. Ooh, inflatable beverage holder, uh-uh. Mini desktop vacuum, okay. A little fan. I know it's getting hot, it's getting hot. What is this? Hanging photo holder. Okay. Look, they got this one. Is this? How much is this? Oh, this is the five dollar one. Oh, I wanted to get this last time. Is it too soon, y'all? Though, is it too soon? Let me know what y'all think. Is it too soon to get that? Well, by the time that time comes, it's gonna be gone. What is this? It's kind of cool. Okay, okay. 
little house. The water. I really like this one though. I like this one for real. I like it. But I mean, you can't really put much in there. That's the thing. But I mean, I don't know. Ooh, this could be cute for the bathroom. Or like a little part in the living room. Put your keys and whatnot in here. Ooh. Paper towel caddy. Oh, wow. Okay. Creative. I love it. Got options with the colors. Little picnic basket, beer containers, can never have too many of these. Okay, okay, stepping it up, I see. Looking at the mugs, this one's kind of cute. The rest I've kind of seen before, so nothing new really. I swear this area always looks the same, just different vases, but the same kind of structure, colors, color palettes and stuff. I'm not saying they're ugly, I just kind of get tired of it. That one's cute. Okay, so they still got a couple summer things out. These are $2, $3. I don't know if I can fit in these though. I'll probably break one of these. The 4th of July things. Ooh, a lounge chair. Ooh, that seems perfect for the hot summer. Who doesn't need lighters? I do. Always need some lighters. Well, no way this is $10. Wrong place. Because if so, I would take it right now. Look how cute these trays are. You got the strawberry, the rainbow. That's so cute. Doesn't say price. Very cute. Y'all see how much R2 costs? He costs almost $239. <laughs> Steep. Darth Vader, he costs $70. Now, are they ever going to do a sale? I don't know. This one's $50. This one's $50 too. Eventually I will get all of these because I like them a lot. But between this one and this one right now, I would get that one. I like this one as well. Y'all, this one's beautiful. This one's $100. That one is cute. I love that one too. I'm trying to find the bonsai tree, but I don't see it. I might not have it. Look at this little mermaid one, $160. That one's cool. That one looks really, really cool. Oh, look, they got Hello Kitty. She's $40. Uh, Mm, cute. The Star Wars pack. I don't know how much the price, but that one looks cool too. There's Chewbacca. $35. The AC Duck. Cinderella. I don't know who Kayla is. Spider Woman. Never heard of that one. Mm, that's new to me. Mm, Ariel. Now I gotta stop with the Stars Above pajamas to see if they got something new for me. They got this one. I'm not loving the pattern, so I probably won't get it. I still have yet to get the gray mat, the gray set, but I'll get it one day. This is the first time ever, ever in the history of Sofia where I didn't buy anything from the three stores that I went into. That's crazy. I feel like I make better decisions on camera than off camera, to be honest with y'all. I'm a little less impulsive when I'm on camera. I know it should be the other way around, but mm -mm. two more stops and then we're done. We're gonna go to the grocery store real quick, get some, get a couple things that I need to get because we're gonna be cooking tonight and Starbucks. First, we're gonna get some beers. Okay, so Corona Extra or Corona Light Extra? Okay, Extra. That's not, no. What? 31? That's crazy. We're gonna get the little pack. Let's do the six pack up there. All right, we got our beer. Now we just need to go to the seasoning aisle. So while I'm over here, have you guys ever tried bus balls? If so, tell me how many did it take for you to get messed up? For me, at one, oof, you can feel it. You can feel it. At one, you can feel it. Now they're not lying about that 50%, 15% alcohol now. Out of all of these, I think this one might be the best. I thought I would like the pina colada one, but I did not like it. So this drink, oh yeah, oh yeah, mm-hmm, 13.9% alcohol, oh yeah. You want to get messed up for a cheap price? Go ahead and get this. Over here, I did want to show you guys some of, one of the ones that I do like or starting to like. This one's really good and also affordable, $8, come on now. Sweet red, I also like Moscato. Remember, look at the ingredients, y'all. I like Kroger brand because 
it's one of the best choices as to they won't add any hidden ingredients so choose wisely all right so i'm gonna get i'm getting this one they don't have cayenne pepper for this same brand so i'm just gonna get this for the cayenne pepper i cannot emphasize enough how annoyed i get whenever people want me to move out the way but they don't say anything like are people scared of me guys let me know am i scary let me know guys because if i'm scary let me know all right the last thing on our list is fish fry i think i'm gonna get that one. Oh, oh, oh no let's get this one seafood breading mix yes let's do this one and that is it y'all last stop is starbucks well guess i should have known better i didn't see any cars I thought it was so open because it's only 7.39, so I don't, I've never seen a Starbucks close that early on a Friday. Wild to me, but hey, I don't know. I guess that means no Starbucks. Oh well. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!